Welcome back everyone! Welcome back to Let's Play Shortest Trip to Earth. We've been in a fight last time and uh, we got a new shiny reactor, which is a little bit unstable. It says low risk of malfunctions, brittle structure. It's only 6 health. But actually, my uh, cooled iron reactors only have 5 health. So, yeah. I think we're fine. Now, we do have some excess metal, which means that I'm just going to turn this on and have someone repair. Who's best at repairs? It doesn't really matter, I suppose, because uh, it only affects speed, uh, speed of repairs. So, I suppose Crystal over here can go and repair stuff. Otherwise, he's... Uh... Alright. There we go. Let's use up some uh, metals to repair our ship. In fact, I'm going to repair all of it. Because we're going to be getting more anyway. So look at that. We're going to be f up to full. Brilliant. Excellent. All right. Off you go back to uh, growing stuff. Nice. This is full of fuel. All right. We could also develop a missile, but of course, I mean, uh, this module, but it does do, uh, it takes 600 metals and 500, I mean, 400 synthetics. So that's, uh, quite a lot. Survival, essential economy, other, well, lot upgrades. Oh, okay. I get it. So that you can filter it. Okay. Well, let's, uh, check out the rest of this area. Lifeless planet. Warning. Access to this mining planet is restricted to Intelligent Bank's TM-authorized vessels. Failure to respect property borders will result in attack by orbital defenses. Let's print long-range missiles to neutralize the satellites from a safe dis distance. We don't have a lot of them, but, well, we managed to destroy the defense satellites. Their weapons were too short-range to reach us. So, alright. The mining site is a mountain of hardstone with a tunnel going in. Markings indicate it's an exotics mine. The tunnel leads to a thick crystal security door within the tunnel. We need to get it open before proceeding. Uh... Let's use energy cutters. Ah, we successfully cut through the security door. It seems mining was temporarily put on hold here and never resumed. There were several exposed seams of exotic minerals, and our bots mined from uh, there until they no longer could. The operation was a big success. Seven exotics and 80 metals. Whoa, that's a lot. I like it. All right. No. Oh. Ah, that Asteroid. Yeah, I know. I know. Um, close. All right, go and fight that fire. Fight the fire! Okay, excellent. And back you go to growing stuff. I don't think there's anything else here. So, uh, we can keep going. Yeah, that's quite far away. To Hersio. Whoop. Unknown object detected. Metal objects. Metal canyon objects! We have discovered a debris cloud of unknown origin. We can scavenge some of the metal and there might be something else useful amidst the broken pieces. Let's do so. Under attack! Uh-oh. As we entered the debris cloud, our ship and utility bots were attacked by sm smart micromines in the debris. This is an active minefield. Operation abandoned. Well, it's not a huge deal. We only lost one health. Could have been a lot worse, I mean... So where is this stuff? Why Why am I... I'm not making as many organics as I was before, I feel. Am I? Oh no, I should be making organics just fine. Okay. <laughs> this, is, this is really cool, having this many uh, organic stations. Planet with atmosphere. Hercio 9. The planet is covered with ruins of primitive, probably digital age civilization. Particular uh, craters on the surface indicate the possibility that this civilization might have wiped themselves out in a nuclear war. Let's uh, scavenge. Our crew found an ancient capital missile amongst the debris, but it was damaged beyond repair and had to be scrapped. That's still, that's still a lot of stuff. Jeez. That is still a lot of very useful stuff. All right. We're done here. I mean, there could be other stuff hiding around here, but I mean, yeah. 
we we do waste fuel going around but we do produce organics and uh uh credits so that's pretty cool now let's go to zeus let me make sure okay there seems to be cool let's warp to destination yeah. lifeless planet Ruins of advanced urban landscapes can be found from orbit, or seen from orbit. It looks like a war zone between some of the elder species. No signs of life detected. Immense size gives the planet a high gravity field. Let's explore it. Oh wow, that's cool. Broken habitation domes dot the landscape. Signs of thermonuclear and heavy energy warfare are visible everywhere. This place could be full of hazardous conflict remains. Unknown urban technology patterns require the presence of crew for a successful salvage mission. Yep, let's do so. Under attack. Brilliant. The urban ruins were full of mines, automated defense turrets, and partially active warbots. Fortunately, we had no casualties and our operatives hauled back two pieces of technology. Further exploration was deemed too dangerous and we've decided to move on. Ouch. 8 points, 5 fuel, 10 metals, and 30 synthetics. But let's see what we get. Oh, large energy disruptor type 209. One time nine shield damage. I love you. Come to Papa. And a Terran squad, uh, a Terran quad sniper mini cannon. Let's see. So compared to our ancient rocket platform, uh, it's the same energy. It uses half as many explosives. It's slower to fire. It's the same accuracy. It's a lot smaller area. It damages, I guess. Ignore shields. Oh, this one never deflects. Huh. Okay. It's four times one, a little more damage, and some asteroid defense bones. But this one does have a 100% chance of fire. Huh. That's quite cool. But I think I still want this mofo. Maybe instead of this, actually. Instead of the ancient rocket platform. I mean, we don't really need to avoid... Um, uh, have weapons that go through shields when this thing does t t nine times damage to the shields. That's, that's pretty insane. I mean, nine points. Right, so we need to get rid of some stuff now. I suppose some of these greweries, unfortunately... So let's put this here. Oh man, that thing is huge. And the 10... Uh, I'll have to be upgrading some of these, I think. And it's gonna be very costly. Slot upgrades. Yeah, this is a lot nicer now to have this filter. Yeah, that's, that's extremely expensive. I mean, I could just, you know... I could just start scrapping stuff, but um, I'm not going to get to that point. Let's, uh... Oh. Oh, is it just broken full stop? I thought it was just damaged. It's weird. Auto-aim. Use targets and fire automatically if possible. Oh no, so it's fine. It just needs repairs. I can... Oh, never mind. Uh, Terran Quad Sniper Mini Cannon. Uh, I think I'm going to be storing this one. Let's grab the bridge here and store this one. Okay, so now we have a little too much. Actually, just have someone repair stuff again. Uh, crystal, go for it. Yep. There you go. So we can repair that uh, health thingy and repair the large energy energy disruptor as well there we go that's gonna requ require some synthetics where is that final oh there it is perfect all right lovely that thing is gonna be insane i love it and having this many point defenses here is pretty nice i think i would want to move this one here though so we have two uh, defenses back here i think that will be a better option all right save that and off we go what else is here middle-sized star planet with atmosphere 
Our sensors cannot penetrate the thick atmosphere of the planet. Initial data suggests highly corrosive environment and a fair chance of life. Let's explore it! We found primitive life, accustomed to thriving in the extremely acidic environment of this planet. We need to print ceramic armor for our operatives to work in here. I'm assuming we're gonna get um, organics for that, but why not? Yeah, let's also research. Harvest organics. You know what? I think I might want to just research. Let's leave it untouched. We're gonna get fate points for that, I think. A few bots were lost due to uh, acid attacks from the local plants during the research. But we got 42 Xeno data. Oh, not great. And we didn't get any f fate. Oh well. Anything here? No. Alright, let's get out of here. Uh, Truthio, one fleet. Where, where, where is it? Truthio? Oh, there it is. I think. No, that's Ara. Okay. I wish, I wish I could just... There it is. Okay, so it is an enemy. Alright, let's uh, load all of that. Make sure that what we want powered is powered. Yeah, we've got plenty of power. Make sure that everything is reloaded and ready. Perfect. Alrighty. Let's jump to Truthio! It is the truth! Hello. Okay, we're there. Let's load the uh, normal stuff again. No more protocols. While we travel. There we go. Okay, there's a warp gate. There's some metal objects here. We have discovered a debris cloud of an un unknown origin. Let's scavenge it. We found a damaged integrity module floating among the debris. Seven. Wow. Manually build hardpoint that adds an extra layer of ex uh, internal ship armor. Can be installed to gain extra ship HP even during an emergency. That's actually quite good. Um... So let's see, this is 600. So I can store one of these for now. Oh, I can't because I've got so much other stuff. Let's get rid of one of these breweries. I feel bad, but there you go. Store this and put this here. Uh, install. Oh. Okay, I can only do it on one of these. Can I move this one here? No. Because that's just... Oh, it's just a container module. <sighs> and I cannot actually upgrade it. Cannot be upgraded. Okay. Um, fair enough. So where could I put it? I could put it instead of this thing. And I think that would be quite good. Because it only gives us two extra evasion. That's not really that much. I think that's what we're going to do. This one is yeah, almost full. Now let's place it here. Alright. That's pretty good. It's also... Oh, it's broken. Look at that. 58 health. I like it. Uh, fine. Just repair that. We do have some metals. There we go. Perfect. Alright. Yeah, we certainly don't have a lot of weapons on the ship, but uh, it's not bad. Local warp gate to Truthio system. And another local warp gate to Truthio system? So it just goes between here and here? I guess? Let's see. Climb to the gate. Yes, it does! <laughs> okay, that's, that's funny. Let's go to the gas giant, get some fuel, if we can. Not enough fuel elements in the atmosphere for cost-effective harvesting. Brilliant. Alright. There's some mercenaries there. Right. Fighty time! Whoa! Damage some hard gits! Right. Let's go say hello to them. 
unknown fleet. Of course it's an un unknown fleet. It's almost un always an unknown fleet. A small fleet of ship is ship. ships is approaching tactical weapons range. They're using some kind of auxiliary jamming devices and decoys to make the exact contents of their fleet unclear. This is nothing personal. We just need to feed our families. Then would you take our friendly donation of 100 organics? Uh, what you need is a lesson. <laughs> ah, so now they come from the front, see? 12 shield. Okay, this thing is going to make mincemeat out of... Uh-oh. Oh, no, they got a plantoid. Biotech. Oh, it's actually... Uh, it doesn't ignore shields, though. We got a big ass weapon, fire cannon, ignores shields and causes fires. They got some cool stuff going on. Uh, EMP ray gun, I don't like that. Mining laser, okay, we're going for this first. I don't like you. Yes, I'm. There. Oh, yeah. Okay, good. All right. We do have the point defenses there, but they don't really have any... Oh, okay, that is excellent. So that cannot go through now. Whoa, did you hear that thing? Look at the damage it did. I love it. Oh, look at the point defenses doing the job. I love the sound effect of that. It sounds mean. And they got three people on the bridge. Uh-oh. Borders. Pirate space bot. Get him. Get him. Out. That's gonna okay. That deflected. Excellent. That one's done. Come on, 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 come on. Ah, oh, destroyed him. Excellent. And destroyed that shot. Did you see that? Excellent. Okay, they're trying to escape. That is brilliant. Come on. Oh, our shields are actually down. Okay. And that boat deflected. Brilliant. Brilliant. And we're not using any explosives. Love it. Our utility bots have salvaged all the resources. Okie dokie. Sorry, families are not going to get fed. So this is the same ECM integrity turret that we already have and an industrial energy reactor, which is actually even better than what we have. Let's replace that. Oh yeah, I cannot. Um, I have to get rid of some of the stuff. Uh, sorry, another microbrewery. Oh no. Yeah, once again... I am uh, wanting for space. So if I need even more energy, I could just place this one down instead of a microbrewery and start making weapon slots. But of course, that uh, it's going to get very expensive. Very expensive. Now look at that. I do have other stuff, actually. I just need more metal, which I cannot uh, store at the moment. So we'll need to do it like... Close to, uh, close to, uh, I should turn this off, close to a station or something. Hmm. I'm gonna scrap this one. <sighs> I could actually scrap more stuff and get enough to upgrade this into a weapon slot, but having two point defenses here really saved us a lot of headache here. Maybe I should upgrade one of these. So, wait, these are hybrid. No, no, that's a weapon one. This is a hybrid one, right? Yeah, this is a hybrid one. And these are not even hybrid. These are internal. So that would be even more expensive. Actually, it's not very expensive to upgrade to a core slot. Hmm. Yeah, not very expensive at all. So I could replace one of the containers. Well, these are probably just container slots, right? Yeah. Only containers cannot be upgraded. Bit of a shame. Well, I suppose I can get rid of one of the... Uh, one of these. Oh, this is a hybrid one. Yeah. But I do like that extra health. I think that's really nice. I guess I could get rid of the shroomery. Or actually, no. I don't need to get rid of the shroomery. I've got these ones. So instead of having these guys work on this, yeah, just have them work on the shroomery. There. Perfect, there we go. So let's store this and move this there. 
Perfect. So now I can upgrade this to a weapon slot. Uh, scrap this bridge as well. And now we can upgrade this to a weapon slot. Yeah. There's the mini cannon. Off you go. Brilliant. Also has to be repaired, but... Oh yeah, let's do it like this. Repair that thing. Let me actually put that on and off. Alright, perfect. That takes a lot of time to, uh, to reload. I think that's pretty good. And we still have excess energy, and we still could have more by putting this reactor in. Yeah, that's, uh, I think that's good. All right, let's keep going then. But of course, we're going to do that next time. So thank you very much for watching. As always, let me know down in the comments below if you're enjoying the Let's Play and what you think about our stuff right now. We are very low on metals, but that's fine. <laughs> I'll see you in the next part. Bye-bye.